Laszlo, you're one of the uh, the co-leaders of the Fearment USA program. So I'd love to hear your thoughts around what you uh, have as the goals for that program, uh, what what you really want to get out of it for uh, for the grape and for the region. I fell in love uh, with this grape variety since something like 10 years ago when I have tasted the first ferments in, in Tokai. Those were the first bottles ever made in the region and in the, in the entire world by the winemakers because the ferment is a native Hungarian grape variety. So I fell in love with this uh, ferments uh, because uh, they're so complex, so deep, so ageable, um, so long, so crispy, like the, the best wines in the world, like, like a good Chardonnay, like, like a good Chenin Blanc, like a good Riesling. Um, for me, it's, it's the best wine. You've been tasting them from their, their infancy in a way, which is kind of ironic in the region considering it's been one of the uh, components of uh, Azu wine that's and the Oscar wine has been around for hundreds of years. Yeah. It seems, do you, do you, find, you ever find it odd that we, uh, we haven't seen dry ferment until only about 10 years ago? I think that we are at the beginning of a, of a very, very long road. Uh, we have to explore which one is the best uh, method to vinify and to age these wines. But uh, after 10 years or 12 years of history, we are on the spot and we are I think that between the best whites in the world. I see wine from all over the world. I see s similar stories play out in wine regions all over the world. And in my mind, I'm always thinking, is that really uh, going to be something that stands out in such a competitive marketplace? Because so many regions are doing that. But I have to say, in my own perspective with the Fairman, I, am, I agree with you. <laughs> you know, the, the you. wine is so good. I hope that we're going to be talking about it the same way we talk about uh, Chenin Blanc from the Loire, or the best cases from South Africa, or Riesling from Germany, uh, those types of things. I'm, I'm really hoping that it starts to get noticed in uh, the same conversations that way. Thank you for uh, for your travel in Hungary, and thank you for tasting together with me this uh, ferments from the Ferment USA producers. And I hope that shortly we will have these wines in the States because we would like to, to build the brand of the dry ferment and of course maybe the off dry and the sweet ferment later uh, in the States to, to have uh, those wines available for all the wine lovers. Certainly look forward to that. <laughs> I can show you. you. I can show you. <laughs>